Nick Rowe here with Javier Gonzalez of the Terriers. Javier, talk about the summer playing with the Brooklyn Knights, uh, Northern Division champs along with players like Chris Antonio and Giuseppe Buscemi. How was your summer, for, especially with playing with those three guys? Well, it's, uh, it was very um, easy, you know. We get along pretty well. Guys have been known for two years already. We've been playing the summer together. Um, I think it was a great experience, you know. You learn a lot. You play with a lot of experienced players. You know, every game, it's a... Uh, learn everything new so I, I think it help us a lot not just me to my other two uh, teammates we learn a lot so we can you know improve for this season talk to us about the training camp went down uh, Camp Seneca Lake for the uh, week uh, before you guys you really got into the New York training uh, what did coach put into you guys because remember there was you know no New York City you guys couldn't be distracted uh, I'm not sure if you guys even had TVs or computers down there yeah I mean I think um, it helped us a lot um, for the team, uh, we don't. We're practicing. We just into practice, you know. Just go there, eat, practice, go to rest, then go to practice again. I think help us for the chemistry of the of, of the team. You know, everyone started to get along with the new freshmen, new people coming. Um, I think it really help us as a team, like a unity. And you know, we work very hard. You know, so we can uh, apply that now. As an upperclassman, obviously leadership is key. W with going to training camp, do the freshmen still need guidance? So after that week of bonding, do you think that you know they know their role? And you, as upperclassmen, you guys don't really have to, you know, push them around and say, you know, you guys are the babies, we're the older kids. Is everybody equal right now after being away? Yeah, I think after being away, you know, everyone learn what what are, what's your ro role in the team, what's your job. I mean. Really, after we came back, there's nothing much to say. They all know. I think, you know, we're very good at that right now. What are your expectations going into this season? Obviously, uh, year three for you. You know, um, team had a, you know, an uprising last year in victories, and obviously players like Semso and John and Alessandro. You know, what are you expecting to happen this season for the Terriers? Yeah, um, I think we got very high expectations for this year. Um, you know, um, I think what happened in my first two years, we're a very young team, you know. Um, now this year, we got more other people, more people experience, and with the uh, newcomers, I think it's going to help a lot too. We got people like John, like Sammy, like Chris, have been doing great, Giuseppe, um, you know. So, very, very excited this um, this season, and very high expectation. All right, going to the first four games, two early tournaments last season. You played UMBC and you played uh, Navy. You beat UMBC. Actually, you beat Navy, tied UMBC. Uh, it's all over again. How do you expect it to go this way this year? Well, we want to get two victories here. I mean, we got to go game by game first. We play Navy tonight. Um, you know, we just want to do our job. You know, hopefully get a victory and work hard and then the same thing on Sunday, you know. All right, that's Javier Gonzalez. I'm